Hello everyone, Dr. Arshitz here. Let's have a quick review on how does ibuprofen worsen the situation of the coronavirus infection. Unfortunately, WHO has always did a very terrible job by stating that they not against the usage of the coronavirus uh, of the usage of the uh, ibuprofen in case of infection of the coronavirus. They even said you can take it if you have fever or pain, you can take this. And this is absolute garbage. If you are infected, this can worsen your case very fast. It can elevate your case to the severe case. And I will explain to you how. Ibuprofen belongs to the family which called NSAIDs, which is non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. In this family, you can find Advil, Mortin, and Naproxen, and others. These drugs work on a inhibitors and also work as kind of enzyme. And they have effect on certain enzyme which can cause type diabetes 2 type 2 diabetes so people with this kind of precondition should not touch these drugs at all and in this kind of uh, situation of the pandemic if you be smart you stay away from the ibuprofen and so how does it work as i said it can cause some effect on the certain enzyme which related to the type 2 diabetes and also it can inhibit the endocrine systems production of the certain enzyme and the hormones so endocrine uh, system is uh, is our glands inside our body such as thyroid thymus uh, and uh, other null gland and all others so these uh, glands inside our body have a very tight uh, relation with our immune system means they signaling our immune system in the case of infection to produce more white cell to fight the infection this is the first reason we should not take it so this interruption of the signaling of these glands reduce our immune system uh, preparation and secondary there was another study which i will leave the link to the paper in the description this Ibuprofen reduce the production of IgG and IgM antibody. And I'm sure by now, if you're reading the news, IgG and IgM is two antibody that produce from the T cells and B cells to fight and uh, block the virus uh, receptors uh, and result in killing the virus. So in this study, as you can see here, clearly using the ibuprofen, reduce the production of IgG and IgM significantly. So what do you think if you are coronavirus infected and you're taking a tablet that reduce your immune system, reduce the production of your antibodies, what's going to happen to you? This is very basic information. Even a primary school student can understand that should not, if you explain this, they know you should not take this. And how can WHO talk against this matter? I don't know. Again, in another study, you can see the number five, the ibuprofen usage of the 100 micromilligram reduce the production of IgG significantly compared to aspirin and others. So what to take to replace the ibuprofen? Astaminophen and aspirin. I will discuss about the aspirin in my next video. You can watch it. I will leave the link to the description, but stay away from it steroid such as cortisones ibuprofen and its family and stay safe and fine till next